Hi, I'm Rich Mann from Rich Mann Poor Tech and on the success of my video to do with the Karcher SC3 steam cleaner versus an SC2, I decided to do a, another video to do with the attachments. Now on an upcoming video, I've got one here on the um, carpet glider, but on this video I'm going to talk about the Karcher window nozzle to go with the Karcher SC steam cleaner, so that's the SC1 all the way up to the SC5. Now, one of the advantages of having a steam cleaner is obviously being able to clean things without using lots of chemicals and something. So, um, I thought I'd show you uh, this Karcher window nozzle, um, but there might be a better way. So, stick with me and I'll show you that later in the video. Right, first thing first, you've got a steam cleaner. So, you put the nozzle just slides onto your handle like so. And then that allows you to steam the window and then once the window is all steamed it allows you to use a squeegee and clean the window there. So I'll show you on the other side of the glass so you just steam the glass like this. And you can steam it at the same time. Like that, and then just... So just... Take the excess water off. Like that. But one of the disadvantages of doing that, so as you see, you've got a nice clean streak-free window, but um, you get water uh, on the bottom of the, the window from where you've you've wiped down. So there is an alternative. Again, still using the steam cleaner. So instead of buying that attachment using the attachment that came with the steam cleaner. So, with a cloth on the end, just steam and rub over the window. And while the window is all steamed and still wet, using a Karcher window vac, Just wipe down same way. And when you do that, you um, get no water. So I just I've already done this window. So as usual, all the links and the prices, current prices are in the links below for both the window vac here and um, the window nozzle set. If you want to see a review on the Karcher steam cleaner and why I prefer the SC3 over the SC2, please click on this link above me. So do I recommend the Karcher window set? Well, for the price, it's, um, it's, it's a handy accessory to have. But my personal recommendations is save the money on the window set and buy a window vac instead. Now, I've used the window vac uh, for windows. We've got a glass table, um, we've got mirrors on uh, our wardrobe, and I've used it on the windows of my car. And um, some of those, I've, instead of using the steam cleaner, getting the steam cleaner out, I've just gone over with a soapy sponge, and then I've vac vacuumed it off with the window vac, and that gives a, a good finish as well. Uh, if you have got a Karcher steam cleaner, um, would I recommend getting the window nozzle set? To tell the truth, I think I'd still say save your money and buy a window vac. Um, I'm going to do a review actually on the window vac and that'll be on another video that'll come up like a complete review. Um, but in short, I'd get the, the cheapest version. If you've got the steam cleaner, use the steam cleaner as I've done there uh, with the window vac and you'll get just as good results as using the window nozzle set 
and you won't have any mess on the inside of your windows. So that's my recommendation. So if you find this video uh, helpful, please remember to like and subscribe. Um, please also check out some of my other videos that I have. Uh, I've got one on the Karcher steam cleaner and the floor polisher at the moment. Like I say, I'll be doing one on the window vac and I've got a few on uh, autonomous um, Philips Hue lights, etc. So please remember to like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheers, thanks for watching. So here I'm just going to show you um, the windows before I cleaned them. And that was the window after I cleaned them. So I'll say thanks very much for watching and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheers.